the problem is uh, when you invoke God as an explanation for that, what you're doing is you're invoking something that is inherently inexplicable. Thereby, you're not solving the problem, you're not explaining anything, you're confounding the problem. You have more to explain. The last part of your question assumed that I was presenting God as some sort of an explanatory hypothesis. And if you look at my arguments, they're not like that. These are deductive arguments. Now what that means is that if the premises are true, that the conclusion follows logically and necessarily. Whether you like it or not, whether you think it's explanatory or not, it doesn't matter. All that matters is, are the premises more plausibly true than not? Because if they are, then the conclusion is logically unavoidable. And so yes, I think they definitely represent an increase in knowledge. This is an example of deductive logical reasoning. And it, it can't be impugned by saying that it's not uh, some sort of uh, explanatory inference to the best explanation or something of that sort.